Hello, it's Timmy. It's Louis Taole. Do you understand? I come back today to show you what is happening in Sudan right now. And our government don't want to intervene in our citizens. They have murdered so many souls and they have killed so many people. You can see how people are running for their lives because government force is clutching with the rebels. And the rebels is fast encroaching and want to take over the military government. And it is happening now, many people are running hater scatter. The rebels have murdered so many souls, and our government don't want to do anything. It is LPs that come out yesterday and say he is ready to voluntarily help and evacuate our citizens. Saudi Arabians have evacuated their citizens, South African, American, every country has evacuated their citizens, but our own government don't want to evacuate our citizens. They want just them to die in pain and agony. There is no food, there is no water. Because the rebels have taken over almost major part of Sudan. Just watch the video now and share your comment. Share your thoughts in the comment section. As it's going on, please don't forget to subscribe and share this information. Comment. People are still running for their lives because the rebels are killing with that mess. They are killing with that mess. Many people are running for their lives. Some are jumping from bridges, some are jumping from flyovers in order to be alive. Because the rebels are coming with no mess. And our government don't want to intervene and help our citizens. All they care is to make money and to store the natural injury. That's why the youth are still protesting because they want Obi because Obi is the answer. Obi is the one that can save our country from calamities that our country is facing today. If it was Obi in the present of today, our citizens will be long evacuated from Sudan. The majority have lost their lives. Rebels have killed so many souls and nothing is happening. Government forces have gone on ceasefire for three days. Agreement with the United States with American soldiers. Because they come to help and evacuate American citizens. And once they evacuate American citizens, they will go back to their country and Sudan will face the rebels in a harsh way. They don't want to intervene. The AU is so useless organization I have ever seen because the AU don't want to do anything to help Africa. What they do is to milk our natural resources, they take it to the West. They take our money, they take it to the West. They go and store it in Switzerland, Switzerland Bank. They don't want to do anything that will favor Africa. That's not what you are. Just watch when the rebels and the military have a crash. This is from Arab news, so you know say it is fabricated. This is real. It is real. We have to. We have to put our government responsible of whatever happened to our citizens in Sudan. <laughs> حسبنا الله نعم الوكيل منكم يا سياسيين حسبنا الله نعم الوكيل منك يا حنتي وبرحان الله لا كسبكم ولسه أنت بتتحاربوا لسه أنت بتتحاربوا الله لا كسبكم لا في الدنيا ولا في الأخرى نتلاقى إن شاء الله يوم لا ينفع مال ولا بنون إلا من أتى الله بقلب سليم وين القلب السليم اللي عندكم أنتم إنتوا ما عندكم قلب سليم إنتوا لو عندكم قلب سليم سليم كان حاننتوا بينكم إنتوا كسبتاني ما حرقتونا نحن كشعب نحن كشعب كان ما حرقتونا حسبي الله نعم الوكيل منكم جميعا عايزين نعمل لكم شنو نقول لهم بارك الله فيكم نقول لكم بارك الله فيكم في الامر تو فينا هنا جو اكثر من ثلاث سنوات وانتم بتتفاوضوا بتتفاوضوا في شنو انتم سودانيين انتم انتم ما سودانيين ولا بتجبروا السودانيين ولا عمركم بتعرفوا السودانيين لا سياسيين لا قين لا برهان لا هميتي لا كل فيكم فيكم خير الله يرحم السودان ويغفر له مات السودان وانتهى السودان لكن بإذن الله تعالى 
لنا يوم معكم يوم لا ينفع مال ولا بنون إلا من تقوى ونحن نلتقي سنلتقي هناك يا أبو يا برهان سنلتقي هناك يا يا حميدتي سنلتقي ذاك يوم القصاص ذاك الله يسلمك God bless you Amen